Hey, how's it going today, everybody? It's Robin. Welcome to Aries by your tarot. So I'm doing your daily tarot card reading and I'm using the Oracle card deck, the secret language of light. So I'm just going to pick a card and then I'll open up the, the guidebook. Okay, so just give me a sec. I feel like this is the right card here. Enlightenment. Okay, so check out the artwork. This is super beautiful. I'll go on a pause and find the page. Hold on. Okay, so I read ahead a little bit in the book and the first sentence, it says, you are waking up from your old habits and patterns. At times you may feel bewildered or not quite like yourself. And that's like, if you saw yesterday's reading, I was seeing that something was sort of keeping you a little bit off balance and maybe not potentially meeting your highest uh, potential. And it could have been something to do with um, that something that you were eating or consuming that was throwing you off. So I find that like wildly coincidental, even though there's no coincidences. So relax, all is well. You are just keeping up with your evolution and the life that you desire. Your body and mind are adjusting and adapting to your new and loving soul perspective. It is common for your mind or body to resist react or panic when you experience the unfamiliar or unknown. However, from this higher vantage, you can change any story that split you in two and heal any wounds. Remember the chariot card from yesterday and they just didn't feel like they were working together? Um, you are not trying to replace a negative memory with a positive one. Instead, see all the components of a memory so that a new conclusion can form. An unbalanced memory recreates the trauma every time it is talked about or remembered. I think this is gonna be really important for a lot of people, okay? This event or person will be blamed for pain in your life today. A balanced memory has no charge or activation and becomes wisdom. You may even come to see a challenge as the best thing that ever happened to you. Once you change and heal your opinion, enlightenment will shine through as wisdom. Okay, so inspired reflection and actions. Each time you walk through a doorway, imagine more of you, more of you is revealed to you. That's a little deep. Draw or color a mandala. A mandala is a design for contemplative meditation that will lead you to your light center. <laughs> Bit of a mandala. Okay, so you are becoming self-realized. In other words, you are recognizing all the answers you seek are within you. Keep up the great work, okay? And it does say uh, for journal work, for seven consecutive days, write or draw three signs that stand out in your day and ask yourself what you were thinking when you saw them. They could be events, a billboard, a book, an emotion or feeling, a person, a symbol, oh, this is a long list, a dream, a song, overheard conversations, good grief, a channeled message or information from your guides or angels. Okay, so I'm really glad that this card came up where it says you could be just feeling a little bit like not yourself, okay? Um, like enlightenment is not just a walk in the park, okay? It's shedding old ways, it's shedding negativity. It is like the hardest thing that you'll ever do for yourself, but with the biggest payoff, okay? So it is gonna feel uncomfortable. It is gonna feel like things that worked for you yesterday are not gonna work for you today. It can be a little bit confusing. Just know that we're all in this together and we're walking each other home, okay? So we are all here as beings of love and light and we all support each other or we should be anyway. So I think this was a really beautiful card and I hope it helped clear up some of the confusion from Wednesday's reading because your dietary change could happen overnight. Like, ugh, that doesn't make me feel good anymore. I don't wanna do that anymore. I don't wanna speak to that person. They're not good for me. So don't be afraid to let go of things. Angel number 444, wow. Don't be afraid to let go of things or people in order to pursue your highest good, okay? Love you guys. Bye.